Okay, so we know that this is the con evidence for technology in the classroom. And we're gonna read through this and then uh, with partners today, you're gonna work on finding the evidence. So this one is called Eye Strain by Steve Apple. Everyone should be following along right now. It says, handhelds contribute to computer vision syndrome, which causes eye strain, headaches, blurred vision, and dry eyes, according to the American Op Optometric Association. I had trouble with optometric. People who use mobile devices often have a higher incidence of musculoskeletal disorders associated with repetitive strain on muscles, including carpal tunnel syndrome, neck pain, tex neck it's called, shoulder pain, and fibromyalgia. We'd have to look up fibromyalgia. It's some kind of muscle thing, I'm guessing. Students may pay attention to apps, emails, games, and websites instead of their teachers. 87% of K-12 teachers believe that today's digital technologies are creating an easily distracted generation with short attention spans. Four-fifths of students aged 8 to 18 multitask while using digital media. Okay. When I look at this, every single bit of this, except for one bit of information, comes from one source. Who is the source for most of this? Talk with whatever your partner or group of three was when we did the crafting the claim the other day. Go ahead. No, 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 very good. Mackenzie, who is most of this? Who is the person to quote for most of this? Um, probably Apple. Yeah, most of this comes straight from Stevie Apple here. What part of it? There is one piece of information that comes from somewhere else. Find out who it is and what it is. That's not a source. Danielle, who's our other source? Hey, I can't hear you because other people are talking, so it's not really your problem. It sounds like it's a problem with other people realizing that it's time to come back to us. So can you do that again for me, Danielle? Very good. Optometric. I struggled with it too my first time. It's recorded for uh, perpetuity now. People will always know I struggled with optometric. So the American Optometric Association is the other source. Everything else, now here's how you know where that starts and stops. After this, there's a period. It's a whole different thought. Can we attribute anything else to the American Optometric Association? No. no. I heard some people say, wow. I heard other people saying K to 12th grade teachers. Well, who's telling you that information? Then? 
skinny waffle. So you would have to say, if you decided to quote this particular piece, you would have to say, now this would be for like tomorrow, you would have to say, according to Steve Apple, 87% of K-12 teachers, do you guys understand what I'm saying? So we don't know with we don't know exactly where that's coming from. All right. When I look at this, I think that you could get four to five pieces of information. So let's shoot for four pieces of evidence with your partner today. Four pieces of evidence. Yeah, there's four sentences. There's one sentence, two sentences, three sentences, four sentences. I got five sentences, so let's shoot for, out of those five sentences, let's shoot for four pieces of evidence, okay? Can we start? Yep, begin. Today we're shooting for four pieces of evidence. So I'm gonna stop this recording.